What's up everybody, welcome to my channel, I'm Emora Morrison and in this video today I will be sharing with you how you can restore a database from a higher SQL Server version to a lower SQL Server version. On this channel I will be sharing with you practical things that you will be required to do when you are a database administrator, especially if you are a SQL Server DB or you use SQL Server within your organization. So you may have tried to restore a backup file directly to a SQL Server and you're wondering how to do it. And most of the solutions you come across, they will show you how to generate the scripts and the data and then import it in the SQL Server. But that solution may work if the database is like a couple of megabytes. But when you're dealing with database like 100 gig, 200 gigs, that solution might not be the best approach. So the solution that I will be sharing with you in this video is to export a backpack file and then import it within the target server that you want to get your database to. So instead of doing the backup, you're going to create a backpack file. So let's head over to my laptop and let's get the demo going. So I have two SQL server running at 2022 and at 2012. So let's validate that by using the select attack version 2022 and let's query our second server. So we have a 2016, my bad, I said 2012 earlier. So it's actually a 2016. So I have a backup of this database, which I'm going to attempt to restore on the SQL Server 2016. So in order to restore database, right click databases, select restore database, browse the location of the backup file, select add, and then browse the directory in which the backup is located. So it's called demo. So right away, right away I got the error stating that the database was backed up on a server running version 16 point whatever. This version is incompatible with the server which is running version 13 point whatever. So the solution is either to restore the database on a server that supports the backup that means I would have to restore to a higher version or the same version or use a backup that is compatible with the server so I can restore from a lower version to a higher version but not from a higher version to a lower version so in order to generate the backpack file right click the database select task and then scroll down to export data tier select next select your location where you want it to be stored I will be storing it in my backups directory on the C drive, select open, specify your file name, select save, and then select next, then finish. This shouldn't take long because it's a small database, no data is in it. So now let's import the database to our 2016 server. So right click database, import data tier, select next, browse the location where the backup was stored, that backup at backpack, and then open, then select next. And then you can change the name of the database as well as you can specify the location of the database files. So select next, select next and finish. And that's how you successfully downgrade a database or migrate a database to a lower SQL Server version. That's it for now guys. Thank you for watching. If you are new here, feel free to give the video a thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel. That's it for now again. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.